Thai passenger traveling on the Royal First and Royal Suit class Thai Airways on route to Europe, Australia, Japan, and Korea destination will be able to enjoy the Black Seal brand premium drip coffee, a unique extract created by Doi Tung Development Project and especially produced for Thai. Its taste and aroma will engage the six senses, sight, taste, smell, touch and heartfelt feelings of passengers in the magically smooth experience at over 30,000 feet altitude. Business story this episode, I traveled to Mepha Luang District, Chiang Rai Province, northern of Thailand to visit the origin of Thai coffee that is popular both in the Thai nation and internationally, including being served for Thai areas. Coffee is one of the most popular products from the Ma Fa Lung Foundation. The foundation was established as a private non-profit organization to help carry out the development activity initiated by Princess Sina Karintra, the princess mother and grandmother of the current monarch, His Majesty King Mahavachira Longkorn since 1972. Doi Tung Development Project was created a job for the local people, have income, and able to support themselves according to His Majesty's wishes for people and forests to live together, and in order not to go back to cut the wood to destroy the forest, shifting cultivation as well as stop growing opium again. The partnership aimed to help generate local employment, a circular economy, and sustainable community development. The coffee beans are harvested by local farmers on hills at Doi Tung, a mountain in the Thai highlands of Ma Fa Luang District, Chiang Rai Province, northern of Thailand, where 1,200 meters above sea level and lost it through a sustainable process by Doi Tung Development Project. What kind of product, what kind of coffee to launch in TG Thai's Airway? We got a very, very challenging objective. Um, they wanted something that is uh, very unique for, for TG. And we had to go through several rounds of discussions with them, trying to provide them with something that um, is extremely unique. And at the same time, both of us are, mm -hmm. are happy with. Um, so the Doi Tung TG uh, Black Silk Blend is actually... Uh, a mixture of three mm -hmm. different roast profiles uh, wow. of, of Doi Tung coffee mm -hmm. uh, in, in different percentages that are, not, <laughs> that are able to bring out a very, very interesting um, taste. Uh, mm -hmm. um, I have to say that when, when, when we finished cup tasting the, the, the profile for, for Black Silk, um, I actually looked at my product development team and I, I, was, I, I just asked them, why is it not our product because it's, uh, it's yeah. so good so yeah so i think i think black seal blend is something that is very very unique um, truly special and something that i think everyone can can really enjoy the name of the black seals it seemed like make me want to drink some coffee how the taste there um i think it's it's very well balanced mm -hmm. um it has some acidity um sweetness at the same time it has a uh, very good body and and of course um, signature of Doi Tung Coffee is very clean, so mm -hmm. the aftertaste is very, very clean. Doi Tung Coffee has a raw community to courses with forests in a mutually beneficial and sustainable manner. Because coffee plants grow under the shade of forest tree yield quality coffee bean, so farmers become protective of forests that provide a long-term stable income from coffee tree to very added processing and the development of the entire value cycle. There are two origins of Doi Tung coffee. The first source comes from planting coffee trees in the area of the Doi Tung development projects. He worked for the royal patronate at Doi Tung and he suggests for key for the cherry bean at Doi Tung is have the green one and the red color. And for the perfect one is a red color that can harvest between November up to March in every year. Growing coffee tree by farmers to sell the foundation. Coffee grower membership registration is required. As for the product, there is a production process that must be inspected, including must have documentation for tech ability. Mm -hmm. 
ันจะลงล็อกลงล็อกนี่คือประมาณล็อกละห้าสิบ Can you tell me about the process of the production for coffee bean from Doi t u n g We take care of our coffee from from farm to mm-hmm. cup. I think we're one of the few um, in this in this scale. So um, when we started, of course, um, selecting the right varietal, the right breed of coffee, mm-hmm. which suits the climate, is very critical. At the same time, we need to educate Thai farmers, our farmers, on how to look after the trees. Um, what What are some of the appropriate number of trees that you should have per r i e and how to look after them? Um, when to uh, put in fertilizer? Uh, when to trim? When to do hard pruning? Mm-hmm. Um, and we we put a lot of efforts in uh, quality, uh, securing high quality coffee, and that again is done through educating our farmers and also through the uh, purchasing. Process uh-huh. which uh, we have very clear criteria on what type of quality that we are willing to accept. Harvesting a production of p a s h m e n coffee from October to February of each year, start picking only l i p red and yellow fruit meticulously in the morning by correcting its fruit by hand, and then bring it to wash as soon as the result to separate the leaf and other debris and sort the side to be sent to the factory. After receiving coffee production, deliver coffee to the factory to remove the other shell by a machine that does not damage the pure kernel. Then be taken to spin the slum by the slum blender. The result will be coconut shell coffee soaked in water overnight. Which the process from collecting to perishing the milkers must be complete within 24 hours. Drying coconut shell coffee. Do it at dawn the next day by washing the coffee shells with clean water and take it out to dry. On a cement patrol, we s p r a y coconut shell coffee every 30 m i n u t e s every day until the moisture content is reduced to 10 to 12 percent. Production of roast ground coffee. Bring coffee to roast, roasted in quality roasters and skilled roasters. Roasting can be done at varied level from light, medium to very dark. When roasting, decarbonize carefully in order to avoid the smell of coffee. There are three levels of grind for roasted coffee: coarse, medium, and ground fine, and mix coffee according to the next receipt. The unique taste, the coffee from Doi t u n g I'd like to say that our coffee is clearer, clearer, mm-hmm. clearer than mm-hmm. than most of the coffee, um, simply because uh, when you focus on um, ripeness, when mm-hmm. you focus on uh, process, and when you are able to roast it at the right profiles that that is, that is suitable to the to the actual beans that 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 you get from, um, you'll be able to deliver that. That kind of clarity in terms of flavor. Our coffee is sweet, um, a little bit uh, say acidic, sweet, uh-huh, yeah, and yeah, very yeah. very clean finish. And how about in the future? How d o i t u n g will develop for the coffee products to the market? I think that the knowledge that we have is something that can be put to a much greater use. Um, we are not only now. We are not only operating our coffee farm in d o i t u n g but we are also operating our coffee farm. Elsewhere, so we mm-hmm. have another uh, area that we are now promoting coffee cultivation, which is in Nan Province. Yes. Um, so we are now utilizing the knowledge. We're working with the farmers in Nan. We are also implementing um, our expand. We mm-hmm. also expanded our coffee operation into Myanmar, mm-hmm. uh, in areas where there are opium cultivation. Oh, so it's similar to what Doi Tung was 30 mm-hmm. years ago, mm-hmm. and we're now trying to use our knowledge in in shifting or changing. Uh, uh, People in Myanmar from opium cultivation to mm. to coffee plantation, and 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 hopefully that will be able to provide um, long term um, licit mm-hmm. income opportunities for mm-hmm. for the people in that area. 
d o i t u n g Coffee products include roast, roast coffee, and drip coffee. They are available at Cafe d o i t u n g d o i t u n g Life by Store and leading department stores. Most recently, Japan leading quality brand Muji selected d o i t u n g Coffee for its own cafe due to its quality and a desire to support Thai farmer to have a sustainable quality lifestyle. Overall, d o i t u n g development project of the Ma Fa Lung Foundation has taken. Care to preserve indigenous culture and tradition, and involve the community in the process.